Now I'm playing from 13th century, the famous uh, Persian poet, it's not Persian, he actually, his ancestor was from Persia. That is the beginning of new kind of music in North India, including classical, semi-classical, spiritual, many, many. So I'm playing something from there. Is by Amir Khosrow. Language is mixture of Persian, Urdu, with several, three, four languages mixture here. Is it? <laughs> Just a little uh, journey through the language journey in our part of the world. It's interesting that uh, we we gone through a lot of evolution in, in the language, and we have, uh, in fact, diversity of all kind of language and, and culture, in food, fashion, everything. Uh, there's Bangladesh, India. Especially is the, is we call the the hybrid nation we are. Our color, our food, the language, everything is having mixture of many many culture. So diversity and be that is the beauty we feel. That's why I feel that this the language movement was very important for us. That it exemplifies importance of the diversity in culture uh, beyond the all national, religious, and ethnic uh, limits. Chop the luck, sabotine, Hari 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 Hari
hari-hari tunggu Bayar pakan Bayar pakan Hari Meaning you was the your eyes of your your loving eyes, your uh, having so much intoxicate you that I fall in love with you and your eyes ultimately taken away all my identity. I lost my identity, my religious identity, my all identity I lost to you because you looked at me. So you your your look with love taken away all my identity. So <laughs> Something from uh, again, it says uh, that uh, is actually 10th or 11th century. Uh, it is 11th century from uh, famous Rumi, Maulana Jalaluddin Rumi. Very well read. He's well read here all over the world. In the, in the recently, I can say last 100 years, a lot of his uh, composition, especially spiritual compositions, are very much popular here in, yeah, all over the world, especially Western world. So something in Persian language from him. It's only two lines and playing his meaning is don't think that I am moving in the market aimlessly. Definitely I have some I'm looking for actually my beloved one and I'm looking for my beloved one. Once I meet, you'll see. So I'm not move, moving in the market just without any aim. And I'm looking for you. Don't think that I am drunkard because I got you know, of course I am I'm drunk. Surely I'm drunk. But don't think that I lost my control. I can show you through the uh, straight path, moving through the straight path, I can show that I have my control. But don't think that I am moving aimlessly. I have some aim. Actually, I am moving, looking for my beloved one. Next one, uh, in, in again, in, this is also Parsi, but uh, it's a mixture of Parsi and North Indian language. It's very sophisticated version of Urdu we call. Uh, Mughal, last Mughal Emperor, uh, in 1857, when he has been captured by British people, after a lot of mutiny was there. So, and that was the last, uh, he was the last independent emperor for whole India and British entered and British queen uh, then start ruling and we became the colony of British regime. So when he saw his situation in the whole Delhi was devastated, Lahore, his Agra was, the capital was devastated, millions of people died and his, his heart was very uh, full of sad and he has been captured, exiled in Myanmar, now he's young owner uh, Myanmar, and he was died, he died there, and this, some few lines I'm reciting, it is his, the, he was the poet, not only emperor, he was also poet and emperor together. He was the one of the leading uh, Urdu Farsi poet in, in our tradition, and he has contributed a lot of music as well, and Ghazal, we call Ghazal, and this is epitaph, in a scripted on his um, grave, grave, I visited that place, I, I traveled, I, I, I was there. Uh, so that is, he said that my heart is in full of sadness, 
and I, I saw how much how much people have been died, how my city has been devastated. And what a pity that being an emperor, I don't have even got a, a small one meter, two meter place for my last resting place. So this is the uh, ultimate tragedy I have faced. So that is his is pain here. So I'm playing, it's, it's very beautiful here. Only the epitaph is, is very long and it's uh, but I am playing only few verses from here. Three, four verses. Uh -huh. When British captured that ultimately Delhi and whole India, this person also lost job and he was sad and of course ultimately they all died. This is Ghalib, Mirza Ghalib. He's one of the leading uh, Middle East uh, poet in that region. I'm playing something from him very, as many is how eloquently I explain the beauty of my beloved one to my friend. My friend has fallen in love with my beloved one and I became enemy to my beloved one. So I am so eloquent in writing, in poetry and speaking, explaining beauty of my beloved one. Ultimately, my friend, because I explained to my friend and he fell in love with my and, and I became enemy to her. But at least I became enemy to her. That is not bad. So I am in her mind. As, a, as an enemy, so that is also important. <laughs> my beloved one her as an angel beautiful uh, from the nymph from the, the uh, paradise so beautifully explained her 
to my friend. I became the enemy and my my friend become uh, uh, fall in love with her. Jikriyus <laughs> pari. Uh, 
So it is in Bangla, but I composed in Portuguese. I converted. Let us see uh, if my Portuguese is bad. Please forgive me. <laughs> now I'm just playing this one, and then I'll go for music in a moment. Uh, this one is also uh, in beautiful raga. Now is evening time, so normally this evening time we play uh, raga having. Uh, you know the raga system, Indian raga system is very complicated to some extent, but not complicated. I can tell you, if you go for major notes, then it is this Iman raga. It means do re mi fa sol la si do. This is the normal like you do re mi fa. So this do re mi fa. This fourth note is minor note actually, if you consider with other notes. So if we put this one as a, uh, if we play this. Uh, fa is a major note, major fa, then you will get the new raga, it's called Iman. I'm playing Do, Re, Mi, Fa, not Fa, Fa, this is the minor, we put Fa, then Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Sol, La, Si, Do, Da, 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 This is Fa. So I am, I am never using the minor uh, Fa. So this is the major Fa, and then we are getting the new raga. There are, uh, Thousands of variation of ragas. It's the permutation combination of notes. So I am playing that raga based on raga. This is composed by my national poet. I convert it into Portuguese. So I play a little bit Bangla, then I come to the Portuguese. <laughs> Sempre 
दिशन दुमेन स्कमर जे that I know he loved 
loves is very much that one. <laughs> but uh, my first Portuguese composition, I cannot uh, but play that a little bit of. My first Portuguese composition in 19, uh, it is 2013 November I made it. In when I was here only for three months. I am just, I, I have been learning Portuguese at that moment. So that was my poor Portuguese, sorry, for, forgive me. <laughs> Uh, in Bangla, Ami Chiro Tori Duri Chole Jabo Togu Hare Devola Kuli Te Batash Hoi Shri Ram Shri 
will be here in the next 44 hours so one hour i finish 43 hours is still ahead of you so until the sunday 6 pm please join us and give a big hand to my friend Yari. Yari.